Let's hop on over to our game here. Let's continue. And uh, I believe, well, we're on chapter three. We were just starting, but I can't remember what um, it was all about. Oh, yeah, the desert. So, uh, yeah, let's hop into that. And um, I don't think we went into any of the levels yet. We might have went into the first level, but definitely not the second. So, uh, let's see what the first one's all about. Oh, no, we did do the first one. That's right, because we unlocked this other gem over here. And a few of the characters. Nibbling on the on the mic, I mute it there. Okay, so present danger. So I think we did fretting yeti. Yes, as per these clovers here. So the second one should be this one here. All right, perfect. Or is that one the complete one? Now oh, I can't even remember. I should have uh, looked back on the stream. No, we never did this one. Okay, so this is this is the second one. So wait, where did that character go? There was one that was there, and he just popped out. Okay. Might as well get as many coins as we can. That way we can get our new outfits and whatnot, which I can't remember what we're actually at. So let's put this back. I think, can I hit it from up here? No. So we could just go like this then. Yeah. Now this one has to go back. Um, how do we flip this one? Oh, there's one right there. I didn't even notice. Um... How come it didn't catch on to... Yeah, I'm trying to, uh... He's supposed to double jump there, but he's not doing it. And he should grab on there, too. Okay, well, let's do this again. So if I go up here... There we go. being a little stubborn this morning. Oh, I didn't even notice the spikes there. I wasn't watching. Okay, yeah, so there's spikes there. I see. Hmm. We're going all the way down. Play the safe, we'll go onto this one here. Jump over onto that one. And if I, for some reason, this bounce isn't consistent to the other kind of bouncing that I'm used to. So it's like you have to kind of bounce with it, like jump at the same time, but also kind of delay it. If that makes any sense. So I guess we can get up there from here. Probably the best way. And I think I could just come back up onto here. Yeah. Oops. 
I want to... Actually, I don't even know if it's necessary to hit the other one. I don't know why this is so difficult this morning. So he won't grab those ones. Let's just make this easier. So it's almost like actually this one up here is really just for that. So I don't think we really needed it. Oh, here's the hidden one. Okay. Oh, we're in the background now. Okay, so there's a little timer one here. Um, yeah, we did poor timing on that one. Okay, I'm gonna redo it. Was it this one? Oh, that one moves up and down. I see. Let me just come back up the same one. Interesting. Okay. I didn't mean to jump off there. I want to do like the double jump so you go over and back onto this one again. We got another checkpoint. Now I think I gotta get that one from this one here. Yeah. That's the end of the level. Not too bad, I guess. Alright, why are these notifications popping up? Okay, so we got a new one of those unlocked. Okay. Interesting. Alright, so I didn't watch where that was. Oh no, it should be around here, right? Yeah, because it's one of these ones. Got it. So we should have enough for a new um, costume or whatever. So we could check that out as well. I'm curious what the new one is for this area. What is that? Like, hair? Your hair has reached enlightenment, a top notch. Okay. Canyon spun cummerbund. Ropes. Nothing better to tie your fashion together. No thanks. Those are expensive too, actually. 
we could get these, I guess. But, um, yeah. Wait, did it change? It didn't change. I don't... It's annoying how sometimes, like, you have to... Do them individually, but that time I did them both at the same time. Perfect. Okay, so the next one is Operation Pointy Thing. But I think we're gonna do... Well, you know what? No, let's hop into it. I was gonna do the other, um... Uh, secret one that opened up or whatever, but I think we'll do this one. Operation Pointy Thing it is. So how's the uh, audio today, guys? I increased the the volume on the microphone to where it should be, like proper levels, or at least a little better. Um, and hopefully the game is okay and not overshadowing. I've been conscripted by General Buttons, who is holding my presence hostage. My duty is to inform you that this obstacle course is built on shaky ground. Move fast. That was my only duty. So now I don't know what to do. Hmm. You follow me. <laughs> okay, so it just basically falls out from under us. Is the idea, I guess. Now we can go over there. We can also go here. Temperature is just right. What is this like a hot tub or something? Or a shower, I guess. Probably missing something because I know there's that bouncy area back there. But, um, I guess there's two areas. Well, no, we bounce over there and then we move up to there. Okay, Let's see what this guy has to say. Excellent work, Fuzzhead. I'm afraid the path ahead is even more treacherous. Don't stand still for too long and keep an eye on the sky. Hmm. Wait a second, I don't want to go ahead yet, because there's this here section. Where where does this take me if that's not the main Oh, up to the letter. Okay, so we gotta keep an eye on the sky, apparently. Oh, and this guy's here again. A rousing display of agility. Come, recruit. Basic training is far from over. Colonel Fluffy, execute Operation Pointy Thing. Okay, so there's, um... Yeah. A bunch of spikes here. Now, we don't need to get all of these. Well, actually, you know what? We kind of do. Because by getting the 300, we get the extra clover. So getting as many of them as we can is good. Tried to uh, time that right, but wasn't quite enough. Now there's no edge there, right? Okay, so yeah, we don't need to get them right now. I feel like we should be okay. So this is just going left to right, right? Okay. So if we just follow this all the way around, we should be good. Oh, and they're also throwing stuff at me? How rude. We can go up there, I guess. And I'm wondering if... There's a difference to going this way? Oh, maybe we need to go this way first. Okay. That's unfortunate. But we should be okay. I mean, we have so many lives saved up from before. I wonder if I can hit those back at him. Yeah. 
I'd like to try. Okay, so the letter should still be unlocked. Should be okay for that. Now that area in there is partially unlocked, so we have to do both sides essentially is what it's doing, I think. Yeah, so both sides should bring him out now, and then we can destroy him. Okay, so yes, you can shoot them back. Perfect. Okay. I don't know, like, it looked like he was gonna talk to me, so I didn't want to hit him if he was gonna be friendly. <laughs> Operation Present Pilfering is almost a total success. Your bumbling has barely a blip on our radar, however, we must de-risk the operation. Our brilliant tactical maneuvering has led you here to this special elevator. Enjoy the ride! Oh, great. So far, so good. These guys aren't that bad. Oh, but uh, that happened. Okay. Now, I wonder if it rotates like the other side. Yeah, it does. Okay, so now... Yeah, if I just deflect these back, that should be all. Perfect. Now, do we get to choose one? Or do we get all of them? Ooh, I think we get all of them. Awesome. Great. Okay, let's move forward. Seeing these walls here broken up like that reminds me of uh, Star Wars. It's like I just want to force push through that, you know, and break it down. I can't. All right. Hi, Lucky. We were able to rescue some presents while you were keeping buttons busy. Thanks for all your help. You're welcome. Now, we didn't get all the letters, I don't think, right? I think we missed one or two. So again, another level that we're gonna have to go back in 100% at some point later. Oh, there's another one up there too. Okay. Now, I believe that was up here. Yes, up there. And then we'll come back to Juicy Tube. So we'll either do this one and those other ones, or uh, just go to the next one. We'll see. Let's um, go with the flow. So we could do this. Now is it yeah, it is pushing us forward. I was wondering if we could have went back again, but we can't. That's neat. You gotta go underneath the spikes but then jump over them. Ooh, okay, so there's different, uh, I mean, I've hit some before, but there's different spots where you gotta hit the, whatever you call those, to flip them so you get the bigger coins and, um, gems. Oh, missed that one. Didn't, I, I need to do the double jump on that, I think. Oh, well, we at least got the clover, which is the important thing, but I wanted the extra coins and whatnot as well. Now, what's up here? The statue. So we gotta get 58, we have 46. 
Okay, we got to get some coin farm in here. Um, but let's go into this one here. And, uh, see what we get out of this. Well, obviously another clover, but I mean, whether it's a side-scroller or a 3D again. Oh, yes, it's, these are the puzzle ones. Okay, cool. Four of them. Welcome back, got another batch for you. I'm thinking these will make a good hard mode for the game I'm working on in the evenings. Okay, so ideally... It's not going to be as simple as pushing them forward. Because... Well, it will be. Like, if I go like that and then up... I can push... So if I push this one up, this one can go over to here. That one can go... Then I can push that one down. I think I gotta just do... I mean, I could just go like this. Still think I messed it up because I was thinking of two different ways of doing it. I mean, technically, I could just go. No, I can't. Okay. I'm gonna do it the other way I thought about doing it until I decided to do it a different way midway through, which obviously screwed it up. So the idea was to go like this, and then like rotate them around. The so one out, and then one up. Oh, come on, go back. And then you go up. Well, you go down and over. Yeah. That's one way of doing it. Yeah. Come on, don't disappear. I can't run that fast. Okay, let's check out the next one and see what that's going to give us in terms of challenge. Hey, puzzler in training, let me know what you think of this one. There's a clover in it for you if you can beat it. Yeah, this guy's been collecting them, but he's like, you know what, if you can complete the puzzle, I'll give you a clover. Alright, so I can push that one forward to there, which lets me push that up to there. Which would work, so if I do that, and then this one over, I could put the center one, and then worry about the next one. So if I do that, push that down. Um, I kind of want this one here. While this goes over. Move him over. No, it's not gonna work. Hmm. Oh yeah, no, it still will work. Okay, cool. I was actually thinking I had to move him out of the other way, but no, it still worked.
Awesome. Okay, I'm done for challenges right now. I want to continue on with the levels. These are actually a little more hard than last time. It's quite interesting. The juicy tubes. Come on! There's a whole section back here. Okay, cool. So we can dig into the watermelon. That's considered ground. And yeah, these have a, a 3D element to it. Vindication! I knew these yetis were hiding away riches. We shall claim these juice works and the elixir we refine from these fruits will propel our armies to victory. We march. They're gonna try to take the fruit from, or the basically the seeds from these watermelons so they can get extra large ones. I guess is their intent. Okay, so how do we get down to there? Maybe from here. Might be a... Uh... No. Well, actually, that's interesting. So I pushed on that, and that gave me an extra... Extra, um, gem. Okay, so I think... Yeah, we're gonna go to this. That's gonna go in the background. It's gonna give us an extra live. And... See what else it does. So we'll take that for collection reasons. We'll destroy these dudes. I think that might have been all it was. Just the extra life. Oh no, there's another uh, lever. Okay, that drops that. Which just gets me out easier. Okay, so it was really just for the extra life. So I don't need... See, I want to try to go up. Okay, good. So I don't want to get the extra... Hard if I don't need it. Yeah, underneath I think would have been better there. Okay, this, this is, uh, okay, good. I was like, are they timed at the same time? But they're not. Now, how do I... I'm probably from back here. Okay, cool. And another one of those, too. That gets me into the background where... What happens? Doesn't look like I can... Predict it. It just pops up a letter. Okay. Or uh, a clover. That's a secret clover. I'm wondering, if I was in those... No, it wouldn't work. I was gonna say, if I went in those... And I, um... Dug underneath, if I'd be able to survive, but no, because he automatically pops up. Wow, that, that's an interesting one. We got all the letters, though. And the end. Okay, so we actually got quite a few in that one. So what were we missing? Okay, a bunch of yetis came back, one new gem. It looks like that unlocked automatically this time. Wasn't that the boss one? Tar pit. Tar, tar springs. 
No, maybe there's one more. Yeah, this one. So how many is that? 54. So we need a few more yet before we can do the, the boss. Let's get this big coin. Let's go up and get that other gem. And then we'll come back and do the tar springs. And then we should have enough for the final boss because... Fret 51, we generally get three per level. If we're lucky. Um, there are four in the level, but we should be able to get three. If not, we could always just go to the, one of the challenge rooms, the puzzle rooms, and get that extra one. Cool. Oh, there's another gem over here. Might as well farm it. Alright, what are you saying? My friends at school are all betting on general buttons, but I'm for you, Lucky. Thank you, buddy. General Buttons keeps talking about his massive army, but so far I've only seen him and Colonel Fluffy. Yeah, seriously, what's with that? Does he actually have an army? Well, I guess we'll see in the final fight. He'll probably like spawn them out or something. Wow, I'm surprised that one came off its platform. Little did the little guy know, I was gonna come over and join him anyways. Need money bags. Come on. Alright, looks like they're having a fun time in the hot tub. Can you help me find my inner tube? I think Mr. Frog had it last. Inner tube? Hmm. You really need it? I mean, this is a hot tub, there's not that much water in it. Let's see. Kind of want to... Is this where I want to go first? I think I'm gonna go over here first. Come on, shoot, shoot it at me. Oh, I shot it back towards me. There we go. Got rid of him. Go over to Mr. B. Luckily they put the safe platforms here as well. It definitely could have made it a lot harder. Now the difficult thing will be coming back because the camera angle won't... Well actually they did adjust it well enough. Um, but yeah. It was still a little... Uh, it could have been turned all the way, you know? Okay, so... There are these hidden ones. Which I guess we'll get first. We'll get this extra gem, and then we'll go down. I guess we don't need to go down here anymore, because we already do have the L. Um, it would just be to get the extra coins. Okay, so let's, um... Go up here first, then. That shouldn't have hit me, but it did. Okay, cool. So yeah, that's for the U. Now, is there one over here as well? Oh, that's the, the secret entrance thing. Excuse me? This is one area where I agree with people that the camera is weird. You really have to watch the shadow. Because I thought I was still over top of the platform. Like, I meant, I definitely tried to go over the B, but I thought I should have been on top of him, but I wasn't. I was between him and the platform.
So I think we're gonna avoid him this time and just continue on. Because he's not really bothering us. Now I'm curious. Imagine they hit a letter. Or hit a coin. Oh, and there's a secret one up here. Okay. Good thing I explored that. Alright, so speed trial, so we just run forward and I think... Okay, so not that way. This way first. Should be... Yeah. Timing's fine on that. Good stuff. Now, does it put it... Put us there? Do we have to come back from that point? No. Okay, good. Alright, let's go through to this other area again. Right. Okay, yeah. Jump and right trigger does that. Um, so this thing moved. Is there a reason for it? I don't think so. These platforms tend to move pretty quick, it looks like. Uh, apparently, I was on the platform? I thought I was on the other one. Like on the... Whatever you call that. Is that like... Is that supposed to be, uh, clay? Okay, so these rotate, right? Is that what happens? I got it. Um, one of ten? Interesting. Now how do we get that one? It rotates, right? Got it. So when did we... when did we destroy one of those worms? I don't recall doing so. Unless he fell in the pit himself? Okay, now what do these do? As we jump on them, do they move? They do. Oh, maybe we have to turn them all one way. Okay. Okay, that shouldn't be too bad. That's pretty easy, actually. But what would have made it harder is if they had some turned one way and the other, and like the front one actually affected the back one. That would have really made you think. Oh, you know what? It's not counting the ones from the beginning. Interesting. Maybe I have to go back and get those ones now. Because I did defeat two, didn't I? But after that reset, I don't think it counted them. Actually, you know what? It's not even specifically the worms. It's just kind of creatures. Okay, well there's the 10. What does that give us? I guess it was just for this area, maybe. Hello, little fuzz head. Okay, so how do we, I guess, just do this? I should have waited for it to come back. Well, I still would have fell. Hmm. 
Interesting. Very interesting how they do the, the checkpoint system. Like, what stuff you get to keep, what stuff uh, comes back, even though you've already defeated it? Like, I don't know. We missed some more letters somewhere. Interesting. I think we had to go back and talk to the guy to give him his inner tube. Because I don't think we found it yet. We still need one more. So yeah, I'm gonna... Probably do that secret thing. I did the one that was up here, right? Yeah, that was the one where I had to run straight forward. Okay, so let's do one of these puzzles. And then we should have enough. Oh, there's another section over there? I don't think I've noticed that wood there before. We meet again. I'm excited. The poetry of all this, the interplay of Fox and Yeti and puzzles, it's breathtaking. Um, so that one could go down there. We don't want that to hit that. We do want one to go there. If I push that one out. Okay. I have an idea. Let's try this. And then push this one back over to there. Which should do the top one. And then if I do it to the bottom, to so push him down and over. I think I know what I did wrong. I should have pushed one down, left that one, pushed the second one down, that over, then down. Yeah, I got it. Okay. I understand now. Come on. Now I just really need to remember how I started it. Okay. I started it by pushing this one up, right? And then over to there. So that way, this one went to the other box. Push him up. This one down, the second one down on top of it. And then move the second box before moving those. Which should put him... No, that doesn't work. I mean, I could do that. doesn't work the way I thought. So if I do that, that's just going to push it right back to there. If I push this one over, it's just going to move all the way across. I could potentially reset this though. So if I do... No, I can't. I'm just wondering if I can kind of reset this. Because I want two of these down here. But then he won't go down there. Oh, I think I was still able to fix it. Except that I didn't move this one when I should have. I forgot to move him. 
That's the problem. I should have moved him first before moving them. Alright. Let's try it again. Okay, so I moved him over. Try this a little differently. If I do this... I move him up. Is still kind of the same intent. I want to move him over. But now he's going to be not where I want him to be. Oh wait, no, that's it. My bad. Good thing I didn't move him again, because yeah, that was... That was actually it. I feel like there's a quicker way to do that, but I don't care. As long as I finish it, that's all that matters. Okay, new one opened. We can also unlock the boss now. Like I said, I don't remember this being here before. So that's new. Or if it was there before, I just didn't notice it. Um, Alright, so yeah, 54. We just have enough, so we'll go up and I think unlock the boss. Then we can continue on with the chapters. And then we can always come back and get the extra stuff later. Because ideally, I just want to finish the main part of the game and then um, get the extras later. Come on. Okay, now I'm wondering, are they going to hide something at the beginning here again? They are. An extra life. Okay. Anything over here? Nope. So it's almost like they put the platform in, it's like, oh, you've gone too far, there's nothing here. But if you actually go a bit further, you'll notice the extra life. Very interesting. Okay, so there's his boat, which probably has the army. And, um, yeah, nothing else around. Alright, what do you got, Buttons? Your military strategy is deft and your tactics are sound, but all this has led you into a trap. It would seem that I have outfoxed you. Get it? Outfoxed? Because you're a fox? To war! I think I could hit these cannons back at them. Oh, I did not expect him to be coming here. Interesting. I just thought he was going to jump like to one side or the other of the cannons. Okay, so fire comes at me and does he shoot the cannons or just the fire? I think it's just a wave of fire. I gotta figure out, I think, maybe he comes at me again, and I gotta hit him. Mm. 
Nope. So, yes, we definitely have to hit these back at them. Oh, but they destroy these too. Oh, so we gotta really make sure that we... Yeah, we gotta make sure we hit a lot of those cannons back at him. Yeah, I don't think we can hit him. I think it's just a phase. Okay, this is gonna be more interesting now. Because that platform's gone. I mean, we don't have to go into that one. I was jumping into some of the circles because I thought... Well, not that I thought we had to, but I thought it made it easier. We can actually avoid some of them. Okay, well, that one's gonna go, I guess. We can't hit all three. That's a fact. What? How unfair. I tried to jump up on him, but I, hit, I ran into him instead. Okay, let's not lose this heart here. I just wish there was less time between these two things, like the different phases. I thought a single jump was enough. It usually is, but... Got hit regardless. Okay, which ones do I want to... I guess we'll do that. It's not great. Can I not get up there? It wasn't letting me jump high enough to, to get on top of them. be nice if I can get him to fall through that hole. Okay, now this next fire phase is going to be interesting. So there are areas where I can actually just avoid the fire. Yeah, like if I can get over here... I need that extra heart. I think there's only three phases too, so... I'm almost gonna have to do this without losing any... anything. Like I said, it's gonna depend on whether I can get on top of the... Okay, we got full hearts. Awesome. That wave gives us full hearts. Get back there, do the fire phase, and then uh, we should be good on the next cannon. Okay, so it's a big circle in the middle. So we can almost just avoid it on the side and just go into the big circle in the middle. That's actually not so bad. Okay. So hopefully this is the, the one that kills him now. It only lets us hit one at a time. Okay, fair enough. Because I was fast enough to get that one, but I think it blew up just as I hit it. I commend you on your victory, recruit. I feel no shame and defeat at the hands of a superior foe. I will learn from this failure and return stronger. I can only hope we meet again on the field of battle. Now, I should go into exile to plot new conquests for my unstoppable army. I just hope Father Jinx isn't mad.
Well, that's not my problem. Yeah. Chapter 4, I think. Okay, what's this level now? Is it like up in the sky or something? Oh, I thought you were a filthy rug. I had no time for you, you at the moment, darling. I'm looking to capture that luminous glow those ghosts have. So it is a nighttime, and we have ghosts. 72, so we were at 54. Okay. And there's four per level. How many are there? Oh, Jinx has a rewrite of chapter? Lucky. Oh, excuse me. Hey, Lucky. Unbelievable. You sent the general marching off and you saved the yetis. Next up, Lady Meowmilade. She's glamorous, dangerous, and she's turning Spookington upside down. Looking for the perfect accessories. She's a handful, but she isn't as gruff as she lets on. She can actually be quite thoughtful. She gave me this gift, along with a sweater. She said she would look good on me. And you know what? She was totally right. I'm passing the gift on to you, but keeping the sweater. Love, Lyra. So what's the gift? Just the coins and the extra life? Lucky buddy! Rock on, man! This sure beats life back on the farm. Guess you could say I bought the farm? Sure. That wasn't a very good one. <laughs> okay, so I think that's all for there. Now there's a couple more vendors there. That's the first level. Um, we can see what our next unlock is for costume Ooh, can I play a carnival game? I'm stuck under the ledge Does this do anything specifically for me? Probably not yet, probably later After one of the levels it probably brings out a, a gem So yeah, I'm just kind of exploring, getting uh, as many coins as I can firsthand, because I can come back and farm them later. They respawn. So that guy looks sad. What can we do to cheer him up? Jinxed. Why, hello, young sir. I am Mayor Spooky. I am sorry to say that you've come at the most terrible time. Our little town of Spookington has now possessed by an all-powerful pop diva, Lady Meowmilade. I used to shine bright in the night, but she has stolen my glow. A ghost who cannot glow is no ghost at all. Please, rid us of Lady Meowmilade and get me back to my glow. But well, she took their luminescence, uh... value to them, essentially. How rude. Now what's up here? I'm pretty sure, I guess that is the boss. Or is it like an extra boss level? No, that is, that is it. Okay, I thought for some reason it was down below there, but I guess not. Hmm, some ghosts having a party? Can I join in? I used to have a friend in Veggie Village. I really miss her hugs, even though they just kind of passed right through me. Oh, I thought you were talking about like before you died and went to a ghost, but I guess there are always ghosts. Okay, I bet you something will spawn over there later too. Alright. So let's go back to that first level. Guess we can get these coins as well. And 
there's a whole other section over here too. Okay, well there's more levels over there. So we're gonna be coming over here anyways. Yeah, these are probably uh, level two, three, four type thing. Loopy lanterns. Ooh, a crocodile. Ooh, we can dig up the graves. Interesting. The statue at 83. Now it looks like this might have something as well at some point. And I'm not sure what this is. There's a door that leads to somewhere. Maybe over there? Or maybe it's just decoration. But I digress. Let's go back to this first level. Actually, let's look at the costume really quick. So we have a top hat and a tie. Or, um,. You know, a bow tie, operational apparel, and tremendous top hat. 14,000 coins. You really got a farm to get all these costumes. Okay, Carnival Court. So, nothing back here. There's a quick little money bag here. Now, did these lily pads go down? No. They, they do move side to side, but they don't really go down, per se. Oh, come on. I have to redo this time one. Yeah, for sure. If it's going way over there, I definitely have to redo it. And then that's not, not, uh, dirt. So let's see, how can I get back there quicker? I guess I could have went over that way. Okay. Also, you can automatically jump out of the dirt when you get to the end, so I need to remember that instead of doing it manually. That tends to mess up the jump. Oh, I missed it because I had to hit this stupid worm first. Okay, I don't want to talk to you yet. Let me, um... Go back and try that one more time. He turned over when I was trying to run on him. He did that before, but I've always jumped beforehand. I was also early on the... That worm's back, isn't it? I was also early on the... Uh, the push forward because they weren't spawning quite yet. Actually, you know what? We might be on time. Slightly. Okay, the worm's not there. Perfect. So we should be able to do this. Yes. Awesome. Okay, that's done. So now we can talk to him. We can talk to these guys as well. This sure beats life back on the farm. That guy again? After the carnival, I need to study for my haunting class. And you... Hey, Lucky, I've got that weird deja vu feeling. I mean, if I knew you in a past life? Probably. Lucky buddy, rock on, man. 
It's the rock on buddy again. Oh, go down here first. I guess it's just a matter of going the opposite way. I do want to get that last one, but... Okay, so they're changing direction. But at the same time, the coin does too. Now, I want to go up there. I don't need the heart, but I want to see what else is up here. Okay, so we can go that way, and there's that. And there's one on the other side too. Okay. Oh. Seriously? I was hoping I was going to drop on that wooden platform. Oh, and the time trial too. Okay, fine. What we are going to do then... I think we're still going to do the time trial first. He really messed me up there on that turn. Oh, come on. The camera ammo, cam camera angle messed me up on that one. I really thought I was in the right spot. So you do have to jump for all of them. Okay. We got it, didn't we? I guess it doesn't... I guess it doesn't give us the... The chest again. Okay, so now this time we can get the coin... On this side over here. And if we come down, I'm wondering, is there anything up there? No. So if we properly come down here this time, we can rotate that the other way, and then uh, get the gem on the other side. Cool. And then of course we can get the, the ladder over here. What a save. Thought for sure we were goners there. Hmm. It's another viewpoint, right? I don't need that heart right now, so I don't want to get it. What do you have to say? No time to chit chat, little fox. I'm looking for my kids. What can I help? I pushed it right into the water. So, did we miss anything back there? There were a few coins, I think. We should be okay to push forward. I don't think we missed any letters, but we might have. Lady Meowmlade hired the Kooky Spookies as bouncers, and now my kids are missing. Please, help me find them. Okay, so that was your wife out there? Or maybe it's just multiple people missing their kids? Or ghosts, not people, but you know what I mean. Multiple instances of miss missing kids. 
Okay, there's one right there, I think. These pop up as I go around in the circle. Interesting. Did you hear that? I think the kooky spookies are coming. Help! Oh, how do I... How do I defeat these guys? I have to jump on top of them too. Okay. Interesting. Because it looks like that you can't go that high, but you can. There you go. That's the last of them? Thank you. I've got goose <laughs> ghostly goosebumps. Uh, I almost said ghastly. So, do I want to go there first? No, that's uh, Meowmalade. What's over here? Step right up and try to your hand at knocking down the stuffed animals. There's a great prize if you can knock them all down. Okay, so I think I gotta go up here and hit that. Come on. That should do it. Oh, yeah. Now what do we need? A lot more. Interesting. I might be missing something at the beginning. Oh no, there's one right up there. That's a coin. Hmm. What is the matter with you, darling? I should have known anyone wearing fur this season would never understand my stylish scheme. But don't worry, I could still make you famous. Everyone loves a legend after they're gone. Time to apply a little of my patented fox remover. It's fabulous. What are you gonna do to me? Box remover? Don't remove what makes me awesome. Okay, so that pops onto there. I don't know... No, okay. I just wanted to test to be sure. I can't, uh, I can't jump on top of them. Okay. I was just thinking in case I needed it for extra height. Oh. It can flip you around now. So if you go onto it, it like flips you on top of it. Hmm. So where do I want to go from here? I guess just straight towards the heart. Oh come on! The thing hit me as I jumped. Camera? What are you doing? I was pretty sure I jumped on that one, but it jumped short. I didn't get that one. Okay, so yeah, I really got to make sure I watch for um, the shadow, see where I land. I've been running away from these guys all night. Please help. Well, good thing this is my specialty. There you go. Spookaboo. 
You did it? Looks like my dad was wrong. We kids are invincible. I mean, if you put your mind to it, you can do it. Nice. Ooh, that's where the, the hidden level is. Can I get that one? There's also another one here. How do I... Can't jump that high. Come on. Okay, so I think it's just a matter of going forward. Which doesn't look that hard. Alright. I thought those things would have actually spun into where the coins were more, but they didn't. I'm wondering if I can... if I still need to get that extra coin. I do. Ah, interesting. I somehow boosted off of that skull to get it. Okay, now this is just a matter of running forward, and then if I go back on that pipe... Oh, on the back side of it. So I can jump on them. As I have to here. But of course, you gotta really get moving. Yeah, and that one, that one comes forward before the other one. So the order is out of order. It's the last to come back and the first to move forward. Interesting. Hmm. They should be right here. There we go. Now, do I get anything extra for that? No. I guess I could get that heart. Um, I think I just gotta avoid them. And get that. That should give us all of the word. Perfect. Ooh, popcorn. Okay, camera, you are starting to be annoying. Just slightly. Lucky, I don't think we're alone here. Oh no. You're right. Are they like trying to kiss him? Stay away. Six feet. Yeah, they're giving him like death's kiss or something. But this camera is being weird. There we go. The family is back together. Thank you so very much for your help, Lucky. Okay, so there's different ages. I thought all the kids were going to be as young as this one. But we got them. And there's only two of them. So we actually got, I think, all the clovers in this one. Perfect.
Okay, so the family's back. And they're ready for carnival games. Cool. And then we got the uh, puzzle challenge back too. Loopy Lanterns is the next level. So what we're, what we're gonna do, we're gonna take a short break to uh, get up and stretch. Um, Cause yeah, it's been, if you've been watching the whole time, it's been over an hour, hour and a half. So it's a good time to uh, get up and stretch, I think. And um, we'll come back and continue on with Loopy Lantern. All right, see you guys in a few minutes. Okay, let's uh, go through to Loopy Lanterns now. Come on! Hopefully you guys got up and got a good stretch in. We have... I thought there was something sparkling off to the left, but it's just this. Like, I thought there was another platform there, but there isn't. Now, I wonder if we can go out onto that log and there might be something hidden. Um, there might be over there. Maybe we can get to it from here, though. Wait, these ones move. Uh, we might not be able to get them from that way, but I think we can get them from this way. No, that one doesn't break. That's interesting. Unless we have to jump on it? Do we just smash it? Okay, so yeah, these ones have like faces on them. We have to jump onto those ones. Okay. I guess I wasn't looking close enough to see the uh, the faces. So there's a locked coffin. Can't be something good in there. Don't want to open that up. Okay, what do you need? 
Watch your step on these waters. They're infested with ferocious gators. Okay, so these change. And it looks like it moves with her. Spooky's glow is missing. So yeah. I'm gonna find that glow first. Then Spooky will have to give me free ride admissions for a week. Absolutely. Sorry, Lucky. I don't have very much time to talk. Nyamale took off with Spooky's shine. We have a search party after her, so if you stumble across her, please let us know. If you, if you have a mind to help us look for her, take this mystic lantern. It will help you view the unseen world of ghostly things. So I could take that, and I guess see some of those platforms myself as well. Um, I don't know if I could jump though. Oh, I can. Okay, good. Now, how far out can I go? Alright. Well, that's kind of a neat mechanic. Um, there's nothing over there. Does this go... It doesn't go all the way. No glow over here. I think hard to see my own glow. Okay. So we can come back to here. And I guess we'll go over here first. Hmm. No, maybe we'll go up here. There's Meowmalade. Um, we could go down here though. So we'll get that. What do you want? I already told you, I did the glow. Get on out of here, kid. You bother me. You found me. Did I be impressed? Oh, that little glow? That's so last season. I tossed it back there a ways. You're welcome to it, if you can find it. Toss it back where? Is this? I guess that's not on any platform. Okay, so those ones move. What about over here? Nothing? Okay, good. I was hoping there wasn't going to be anything too crazy. And again, I don't want this to be the way forward. Oh, some extra ones over here. Beauty. Okay, this leads us to that. Uh, I think I could drop this and go like that. Hopefully that stays there, but let's get this, uh, this hidden one. Or puzzle one, whatever you want to call it. I don't know, wait. I don't even know what those ones are called. Okay. So... This is very similar to how we got here, but it's different, so we should take this again. Okay, so those guys try to hit me. Now, I want to come back because they have their scythe. Um, I want to try to get these ones over here. Now, what else? It, it goes up there. Um, we could drop. Oh, but dropping puts me back onto the other level. I think. That looks very similar. Now this puts me up top to the gem, I guess. Yikes. Okay, so yeah, where am I? Am I still on the same secret level? I seem to find a way back up, right? Actually, I feel like 
This is the other level again, isn't it? Yeah. So that actually just teleported me up to... Okay. Interesting. Um, now what I'm wondering is, anywhere that is, there's a floor, right? Because this one here looked like it wasn't right where I needed it to be, but I think it is. Okay. I feel like I'm going the wrong way. Ah, we got it. Now, was that all that was over there? I think so. Yeah, that makes sense. Cause that was the camera angle. Um. Okay. So if I let go of this, I guess I can go through that area. Yeah. So that one's seeing that just because that one's there. Now we need to get back over there. Can we take this? And uh, no, it won't let us. Okay, so this was strictly for this. I wanted to try to get back over to that other area again. But I think we have to drop down and um, go in the gators and get back over to that spot again. Hmm. How do we get back to where we want to go? Oh, we can just walk across here. Fair. Got it. So do we need to go up here again? I can't remember if we got that gem. We did, but then we fell down. Alright, what's over here? I feel like there's got to be something, something hidden here. I don't know why my shadow is way down there. That's kind of uh, incorrect. So I think that's only if I lose one, I can come back and get that one. Okay, so we just gotta push forward. Hmm. I think just go down? From here, you can see the whole treehouse. No glow, though. Okay, so we're still not able to get near the glow. So that was just kind of a different way around. Hmm. So I do want to go down there. It looks like there's a platform there that gets us back up. So I want to get this uh, letter. We need to get the L and the U yet.
Okay, good. We have a checkpoint there, in case we mess up. Um... I guess we'll follow these. We can destroy them, right? Okay, cool. Now... What does this do? Okay. And this should be nearing the end of it now. That glow is so close, I can smell it. Or actually, I think it might be time for a bath. I see. Hmm. Do we have to we do have to grab it. Uh, what do we do with it? Because we can't jump, so what do we... We have to destroy these guys? The glow's gone again. So I feel like we weren't supposed to bring it down here then? Do we just bring it down to him? That's what I thought, but I couldn't get back up. Spooky's going to be over the moon with this, thank you. Well then, I suppose you'll be needing a way out of here then. Allow me if you would. Hmm. Parting gift, that's the next one. Ah, it feels so good to glow again. This will really increase my visibility in the upcoming election. Good sir, all of Spookington is in your debt. You are always welcome here. Fine, you win. I give up. Hashtag so bored. Whatever. Oh, I almost forgot. We killed enough time with this heartwarming little scene for my dad to get here. I'm off to bigger things while he destroys you. Hashtag die now. Yeah, don't use that hashtag. That's mean. Sometimes I wonder if there's a reason for uh, going under some of those areas where there's nothing. But I guess not. Okay, let's uh, move on to the next level. So this train just automatically moves? Lucky, good to see you again. We're taking the show on the road. Miyamalade sent his parting gift. However, there are monsters all over the train. Could you be a pal and clear some for us? Have a care while you're at it. We spirits have notoriously lack safety standards. Okay, so don't fall off, basically. Right, 
Imagine I can get in front of him and distract him. Wait, there was no fire there though. So I need to not go there. What if I go under here? I can't. What if I go under here? There's a ladder. Cool. Anything down here? Nope. Ah, monsters. Thought for sure I got out of the way of that one. Oh, come on. I tried to hit them first, but you can't hit them until they fall down. And I tried backing up, but... Eh, it is what it is. Yeah, so I'm pretty sure this one was invisible when I hit that one. Okay, so these ones I think I have to go backwards. Yeah. Can you not... Okay. I was hoping that would have opened the door, but I guess not. I have one more heart. What? The checkpoint's right there, too. Okay, speed run time. I don't need to go down there this time. Only to get the coins, but... Interesting. So the speed's different on that one than usual. There is a heart in there, though. We don't need it at the moment. Now there's something in there, naturally. Can I not jump off? Ah, I see. Now these are like this, and then wait for those ones. There's something in there as well, I believe. How do I... How do I get up to there? Oh, I can probably switch it. Okay. So that's a secret one. So instead of going to a separate level, we just had to do that. I think it'd be better if we just went down below. Oh cool. I didn't even realize the letter went down there. Okay, so it's this type of fireball. I timed that so very poorly. Um, I think I want that later.
Yeah, I can get that one here. We got all the let the word too. I think this is just a matter of running forward, because there's a gap there, right? Okay, so we got all of them on that one. So really, this door was just for a gem to be displayed? A guardian restoring the Book of Ages to think it's happening right here on Spookington. Yeah, so nothing else spawned down here. There was that other empty gap somewhere. That's probably going to be where one of those ghosts come back. Let's go into Jinxed. Jinxed is next. We're at 65. We need to get to 72 for the boss. We should be on track. Ooh. Is this him? Well, Lucky, we meet at last. You have defeated my children, but no matter. They are nothing when compared to the awesome power of the Book of Ages. With this final chapter of the book, I can rewrite the story however I see fit. I've got other matters to attend to. In the meantime, enjoy my maze. Farewell, child. Very well. That is Jinx. Okay. Um, I guess then we don't want to step on that. Now I'm wondering if we we missed that one. Well, we can probably get it from here. Now there's a letter up there as well, so we gotta figure out how to get up there. Probably from there, just jump straight across. Uh, there's also that secret area. Let's hop into there first. Assuming there's no letter out here. Get that out of the way. And then move forward, try to get that L. Okay, cool. So, probably gonna have to go forward, come back to here, and then of course they're there too. I wonder if they spawn, like respawn. Okay, so that one's not there. So we just need to go over here and avoid all of them. Because otherwise, if we hit them, we're gonna be wasting time. Okay, cool. Now, I'm wondering why there was one empty one back here. I guess it didn't mean anything. Hmm. Interesting. Okay. There we go. I always forget to spring up properly there. Excuse me, game? Was there a point to pushing me off the edge there? Um. So yeah, let's try going up here. Because I think my theory is... Okay, maybe just from this one. No. Hmm. You know what it could have been? It might have been to bring the worm onto that and then shoot up. Or if it goes up and then I jump? No. I bet you had to bring the worm onto that and then bounce off of him to get up to the ladder. Because I can't jump over from here, right? Or is it safe to jump on the fire? It might be. 
You only get one bounce though. I'm pretty sure I needed to go onto the worm. Okay, well. Where do I go from here though? Do I just jump down? Because I know there is an empty spot. I mean, I know there's a platform there. I really want to get that letter. There we go. So that time it worked. You just have to take a leap of faith there. Come on! Thank you. Extra life. Not that I need it. Okay. So I want to go back to this one. And, okay. Don't jump onto that. How about now? Thank you. Thought for sure that was gonna... Um, I think we want to... Go down? Can we go into here? There's nothing in there, okay. I thought we could have walked under there. So there's a path there and a path here. Now that's a checkpoint. I feel like I don't want to activate it yet because it'll be in the wrong spot. Okay, so there's three of these we need to hit. We need to get onto that one too. Okay, now what did that do? Oh. A letter. Awesome. Okay, so that one pops out that way, and that one pops out that way. Hmm. Poor jumping, of course, but, um... Yeah. What? Excuse me? I guess I do need all these extra lives now. Because for some reason... Um, this game does not like to give me a proper camera angle. That's unfortunate. I don't think I can get back to it either. Okay, we'll have to redo this level then for some of that stuff. You've come far, young one, but your meddling in my affairs has gone long enough. Your journey will continue no further. See you soon, Lucky. So wait, did he say this is our last chapter? I'm pretty sure there's more after this though, isn't there? Can I please get onto the right plane? There we go.
Hopefully we're doing this right. I think we're okay yet. Is this the way up though, or is this the way up? Hmm. Let's check. Okay, cool. Okay, so is this just a matter of running forward? Kind of. That one's actually like the simplest one yet. Okay, nothing... Well, there were those, but for some reason they weren't showing, so... Wait, does this seem familiar? Are we have to do this all over again? Oh, so we probably went the wrong way. We went down when we probably should have went up at some point. So there we went up. Maybe we should have went down? Cause yeah, now this way is blocked. And that's fully blocked. Okay, so we gotta go down. Ah, okay, so here we go. Now this is different. Um, is this side open now? It's not. Hmm. So now we gotta go down here. This gets us back to him again, right? Okay, so that's all. We just missed the C. Okay. I thought it was actually going to put us through the loop again and have to go, like, instead of going up, we had to go down, you know, to, like, unlock the, the right gate. Okay, so four more. Well, we still have that one, and I don't know what that is in the distance. Is it that, I guess? Okay, so that was Jinx, and the next one is Jinx something. Oh, it's just a spotlight. That's what it was in the distance. Okay, Jinx is rewrite. That's the next one. Now, where was that other thing that opened up? A little puzzle area. I should go check that out too. It actually wasn't. Oh, it's right up there. Okay, let's go check this out. We get one extra one through this. So we, all we really need is three in the level. But I'll probably try for four. Okay, so I'm going to let it kind of automatically take me through. I'm not going to jump, I'm just going to let it go. Now here I need to jump. Double jump even. Huh, definitely go under there. Good thing I did that. Ah, missed that one.
I missed that one too. Okay, automatically jump off the bounce. I feel like I could have went under there too. But that's okay, we wanted to go up there to get that gem. Ah, cool. Got it. Ah, I missed that. I didn't even realize there was a, a coin there. Excuse me? Oh, game. I was right there at the end. It's right there. Focus on this. Interesting. Okay, so you... Uh, you can't get all of them there, I don't think. Unless you get it earlier on. I need another heart. Wow, I'm doing worse on the second run. It's always like the first time luck or whatever, whatever that's called. Beginner's luck. Because I'm focusing too much on what I already know that's coming up, and that's not it. I thought it was almost too short there. Okay. I think I could have jumped up there as well. I missed that one. I, I definitely got it last time, but not this time. I gotta stay under here, right? Yeah, because that one comes up. Cool. Much better, except we missed two things that I wanted to get. That's okay. Yeah, so we got one out of that, which makes sense. So let's go up to Jinx's rewrite, which actually is down below, sorry. Down here. Okay, Jinx is rewrite. Come on. All right, this looks quite interesting. Right off the bat, they give us an easy L. But here we get these coins. We get these ones. Now we get that big one there. Didn't want to get that yet. That's okay. I think I want to go back and get this coin because it's going to be useful for our total. Okay, so do we go that way first or do we go to the right? I feel like we go to the right and get these and then come back. Okay, so there's that secret area. Maybe let's do that first. See where it puts us back out and then we go back like that, I think. Now they're just making the glow go left. And it disappears at that point. 
there's no real overlap. We do, we could jump over. Oh, it's tricky. Yeah, I feel like I should have went the other way, maybe. Let me see. Which one's more consistent? Well, I could go towards the center and jump on top of the center. Oh, I did that wrong. Let me redo it. Because <laughs> I, I need to wait till like, they're right there. And then I need to follow them. So, almost be right where they are. We got lots of time to do it though, actually. So I can actually wait until, yeah. Yeah, we got lots of time. We could almost just come right back. That's how much time we have. Okay, cool. It's actually not as bad as I thought. Which is a running theme in this game. You think it's quite bad, but it's actually not that bad. I thought about going up here and then just dropping down at the time, the right time, but um, watching how long it actually took made me realize I could just run around and chase them still. Oh wow, three big ones here. That should definitely give me a boost. Okay, yeah, so we definitely have to go back this way. Now, I don't know, I mean, it's a little tricky to find out which perspective they're on there. Oh, there's fire there. Darn it. I really need that hurt. Definitely wanted to stay down there. I can't get hit. I only have one heart. There we go, we got full on uh, checkpoint. Okay, so... I think we just need to go... Straight across. Oh no, we're missing that one. There we go, we got it, but then we jumped off. Uh, but at least the checkpoint's right there. Oh, we missed the one at the back. Okay, cool. Now, is there anything back here? I don't think so. Oh, that's how you get to that. Good thing I explored it. Okay, this fire just went by. That one drops when that is down. Okay, no fire here. It's a matter of doing the right timing. Okay, we got our 300 clover. That's good. There's a hidden area in there somehow. Which might have been related to when we got that letter. Or, yeah, it might have been related to when we got the letter. I was trying to do something nice, and it just drops me off the map. Thank you. I appreciate it. Okay, whatever. Let's just continue. You are persistent, I'll admit. Your sister was persistent as well. She failed to stop me. Now you will fail. No, I won't. I'm persistent at being persistent. <laughs> Okay, so that lowers 
something. Interesting. I'm guessing that chain right there. Hmm. Is it just a matter of defeating them? And then the other side. Okay, so he brings up two chains. Maybe just goes higher. And then there's probably another one down below. At least the perspective worked better there. Oh, there's fire down here too. I did not expect that. Oh, come on. I was behind that wall. Game. At least I didn't die. Okay, we just have enough now. So I think we're gonna go check him out. And uh, get the boss part done. Yeah, I was right. So one of the gems did come back to here. But yeah, we should be good to go up there now and uh, spawn the boss. Do it. Is this Jinx too? Or is it Meow Merlade? Let's see. Oh, it is Jinx. Okay, what kind of trick do you have? So the wave is a jump over those. Mhm. Mm when do I get to hit you? Wait, did he do something during this too? Oh, okay. That's not so bad. Oh, interesting. Okay, so he really manipulates it. So at that point, I will have to jump over. I was trying to do it without jumping. I got it now. See, this one here, I thought I jumped over it, the first one, but I didn't. I thought it was going to come out faster, I think, was the issue. I was right beside it, and I thought it was going to move out right away. But it had a bit of a delay. Can he shoot through this? Yes. Okay. So it's best to stay on this platform then, and just jump back and forth. Interesting. Okay, so they're coming from the other side this time. But I can still do this trick. Until he starts rotating it. And we're still okay, but then he rotates it again. And we're still okay. Okay, give me the attack phase. Oh wow. Do I just hit that at him? Okay, I gotta do that three times then. Okay. Fair enough. And we got some enemy phases. And you're also going to throw those down. 
and they're a little more frequent. Ooh, now I gotta bounce between this. Not too bad. I mean, considering this is supposedly the final boss, this isn't a bad phase. Uh... Oh, I missed the attack phase. Interesting. Um, I went to it to attack it, but it blew up instead. Did like take too long to get to it? That's kind of trippy. Okay, so I'm wondering if he puts me right back into the maze phase. Yes, but I gotta get there quicker, I think. There we go. Okay, so one more of those, I believe. Usually it's usually it's three. That should be enough. Oh, but the camera! I was on top of it! Was I not? Chat, was I not on top of the guy? It's okay. I understand his phases, so it's actually not going to be too hard. You know what? This might not be the first phase, because usually he does the same thing. So this might be a checkpoint. I can't tell, actually. Because there's a lot more of these fire. Hmm. Either he had a harder first phase this time, or that was a checkpoint. Okay, yeah. So that was definitely the first phase. Interesting. I just keep doing this. Okay. Safe at last. Okay, give us a chance to attack you. Okay, we gotta go all the way around. And hit it before I get to it. So that way it doesn't blow up in our face. And these are these enemies, okay. Yeah, he's pretty easy, he's gotta hit him three times. Ooh, these are more instant. Except for the last one. The last one had a bit of a delay. Okay. 
Um, yeah, we could just do that. Okay, two hearts. We cannot lose. Just seeing the pattern. Imagine he also dropped those uh, proximity things too during this phase. Oh man. Okay, maze time. Oh, it's gotta go all the way around. Oh no. It hit us instead? Really? I wonder, hmm, why did it hit us? Because we, we hit our tail first. Interesting. I thought maybe that was the what it was supposed to do, but there's no point in it giving you damage, so never mind on that theory. And I also thought it was like a time thing. It is a time thing. So like, you kind of really have to know where to be in that maze to start. Otherwise, it blows up. So I have to be a lot closer to it. Also, do I not get hurt back when I destroy the enemies? The other bosses, when you destroyed the, the enemies that they spawn, like the bees and the worm, um, you would get full hearts back, I thought. Unless I was already at full hearts at that point. I might have been. Yeah, I might have lost all the hearts in the phase after those enemies. I don't know how to get to this faster. Like, you just kind of got to be in the right spot. So I feel like I got to be like right here for that third one. Cause it like rotates around. Okay, so I have two hearts. Oh, one now. Let's see if I get full after this. Oh, per enemy I get one. Got it. So hopefully, yeah, by that third phase, I'm at full hearts. And if not, I gotta get them back during that enemy phase again. If you get them just off the edge, you can come back on. Hmm. That was a double one. Couldn't jump when I wanted to. So the trick with this phase is you just watch the fire, less about what he's actually rotating, because you'll probably be able to jump where you want to jump. Yeah, not enough time. Huh? We got it. Okay, so the third one I'm pretty sure we gotta be like right here. Because it starts like there and it rotates all the way around. Now I'm not sure, I'm pretty sure it has to be facing him, right? Okay, we got full hearts, but we're okay except for the stupid bombs. That's what's gonna mess us up. We should be okay on this. Like I said, if you extend him far enough, he shouldn't be able to get back to you in time. Again, the fire phase, we should be okay as well. So 
So I, I figured here, right? This is my theory. Nope. Oh, but we got to it in time. Awesome. Goodbye, Jinx. Lucky, you did it. You defeated the kid litter, stopped Jinx, and saved everyone in the book. I am so proud of you. Lyra! Every story needs a hero. And while some are born into greatness, others, well, they can look just like your little brother. <laughs> It may be the end of this chapter, but somehow, I think his story is just beginning. Hey Lucky, how about on your next adventure, we go together? So are they thinking of doing a co-op sequel, or DLC is co-op? I'm trying to figure out what they're trying to tease there. Alright. Well, that was charming. Definitely picked up difficulty a bit, you know, as uh, it went on near the end there. But, um... That was great. Great little relaxing game. Um, some moments where the camera was not proper, you know, because it's hard to figure out in the third dimension where to go back and forth. But if you watch the shadow, it's okay. It actually wasn't as bad as I thought people were saying in, in reviews. They were saying that um, you really couldn't figure out where you were going at times because of the camera, but I, I was okay with it. You just have to watch where you're going. Um, the puzzles, they definitely increased in difficulty. There's a few more I gotta go back and do yet. So those are fun. And um, yeah, I think off stream, I'll go back. And maybe get some of the extra stuff. There's a potential to record it for YouTube to add to the uh, live stream archive. But otherwise, I think I'm happy with with that game and completing it at this point. Um, we completed it in two streams, so that's good. It was about it's only about five five hours, six hours. So that's pretty cool. I'm happy I finally got back to it because, like I said, I was excited for it when I first saw it announced. And, um, definitely had to check it out at some point. So, there you go. I can't skip this. Oh, I can. There we go. Um, but that's a super lucky, well, super lucky's tale. And, uh, what do we have here? This is all the DLC, which I don't have. Okay. Cool. Hope you guys enjoyed that just as much as I did. I think, uh, we're gonna call that a stream for the morning. I've completed what I wanted. I don't know what else to do. So, um, yeah, thank you guys for watching. 